So here we are at the world famous Safety Harbor Resort and Spa. Let's see what's happening. Oh, what a cute statue. Look at all those mermaids. We're passing the fountain grill. This is the main resort check-in facility. Passing the fountain grill for spa cuisine. Here we are in the lobby. Like a dress? Sunday brunch, $30 a person. Yeah. And here we are on the outdoor deck at Safety Harbor Spa along the pool. Look at the great looking palm trees, the landscaping. Everyone here is working on their tan on this beautiful day in Florida. Very retro. The place is immaculate, clean, no cigarette butts. The palm trees are well organized and cut and trimmed. Very nice. I see a lot of spa people wearing bathrobes and stuff. I understand there are memberships available here. Palm trees, well manicured, landscaping. Takes you back to another era. I feel like I'm in the Catskills. Is this grossing hers? I love passing through the Parthenon Spa. Passing the Parthenon Spa. I love the beautiful Dork columns, gold tops, healthy cuisine. Everyone looks so happy here at Safety Harbor. Corporate functions are welcome here. Now let's do a wide view of the Safety Harbor Spa. Before we're looking at the balconies of the accommodations on the pool deck. There are tents for functions. Over there I, I see some kayaks sailboats that are available for a rental and then here we are in an air-conditioned tent for social functions happy hours or mitzvahs this is where you can have small weddings along the bay here safety harbor very elegant look at the lovely lobby here in safety harbor very classically decorated some crystal type chandeliers leather couches but you should let your feet sink on the carpet. The pad must be five inches deep. Look at how my foot sinks. Amazing. This guy's playing the piano. Very classy, very elegant. Oil paintings, crystal, wood doors. Some people might say this place is dated. I love it. I know there's probably days where they just want to turn everything into condos. But look at this amazing room here. Think of all the weddings and bar mitzvahs over time. There's also meeting rooms and a theater for presentations. Let's explore the history of the Safety Harbor Resort and Spa. Hernando de Soto is rumored to have hung out here. And look how this looked in the 1930s. Dr. Baranoff created and expanded the resort in the 1950s. Located on 22 acres overlooking Tampa Bay, it became a great healing and resort facility. Healthy dining. 1991, the Kumar family purchased a spa and fitness center. Look at some of the spa treatment rooms. And a lot of quiet places to read a good book. Well, here we're at the spa boutique. Look at the beauty products that are available here. And look at this waterfall adjacent to the stairwell leading to the ground level. There are boutiques for clothing, souvenirs, and other cosmetics. I love the red carpets here, very vintage. And the hallways of the rooms are very well maintained. I like the multicolor carpeting and original artwork on the walls. Not often do you see an appreciation of oil painting. Now you're looking at the lovely view of Tampa Bay here from the Safety Harbor fourth floor. Look at the waves and the great landscaping. And look at the lovely flowers here. I'm gonna take a stroll along the waterfront and see what's going on. And let's do a wide pan of the Safety Harbor Resort. 
I love the vintage architecture from another age. Now we're walking along the municipal pier directly in front of the resort on Tampa Bay. Straight ahead is Tampa. Let's zoom in and see what we can get. Impressive. And look at the beautiful marina here at Safety Harbor, directly on Tampa Bay. And now we're looking at the fitness facility here in Safety Harbor. Tons of equipment. This is where you do the yoga, the spin, and different types of aerobics. And there's a beautiful indoor pool here too in Safety Harbor, overlooking some whirlpools and an outdoor lap pool. Now's your chance to subscribe, like, and comment 